Hi, my name is Connor Gordon and I'm a sophomore here at Anderson University. I am majoring in history education and eventually I'd like to go on and get my master's and teach uh, high school education. I had two very different high school experiences after transferring from a very large high school to a very small high school. Uh, and this taught me the importance of relationships in the classroom, which I think honestly is a huge strength of mine that I bring to the profession. I know uh, regarding technology in the classroom, how important a PLN is to me as an educator. PLN is almost essential. It opens a whole new world to me of ideas and opinions and connections with people all over the globe. These people could be studying in the same field as I am, we're just educators in general, but overall I think there's a lot to be learned there. Just recently, I read an, an awesome article about social emotional learning and some of the pros and cons to that. Um, outside of my PLN, I know that technology is constantly changing, especially when it comes to, te to technology in the classroom. I believe that in order to be the best you can be as an educator, you have to be willing to try new things and to be a lifelong learner. I don't necessarily think that you have to use everything, but I, have to, I think you have to be open to new strategies. I don't believe that it is fair to ask my students to be lifelong learners and then to not follow the same philosophy in my own career. I believe that technology is a tool for learning and it's not the focus. I think that you have to put the technology, I believe that you have to put the effectiveness of the learning first. And if and when the technology becomes a part of that, then to put the technology in. But learning must be at its highest when using the technology. And if it's not, and then the technology is causing students to lose focus or otherwise hinder their learning, then I don't think the technology is uh, any longer essential. I can use technology to make, to make learning effective and more enjoyable. I can also use my PLN, as I mentioned before, to keep up to date with what's going on in my field and what's working for other people. I'm also super comfortable with the learning management system, uh, Canvas. I'm able to create assignments, uh, create pages, create and grade quizzes, and uh, most of the other things that come along with using a learning management system like Canvas. I'm also able to use Kolb's triple E model to evaluate new technology for my classroom. I am also able to teach students how to be good online citizens and how to be safe online. Just recently I made a podcast uh, talking to students about the dangers of digital addictiveness and how they can use uh, different strategies to limit their time online and to make the most of their time online while not getting caught up in being on their device um, for any more amount of time than is healthy for them or than they really need to be. Thank you so much for taking the time to listen to my video about what I know, what I believe, and what I can do with technology. I look forward to hearing from you soon.